Hi, I'm Rosie Tapner. I am the Bet with Ascot ambassador for the Autumn Racing Weekend and Ascot Beer Festival. Now, Bet with Ascot are giving you the chance to win £500 without even backing a winner. All you need to do is put your play spot bets on. In your race card, you will find a form that you need to fill out and hand in with your play spot bets for you to be in with a chance with winning £500. You don't even need to back the winner. How good is that? So onto my place pot selections. I really like for the first race, number nine, Maygold, who beat Air Cabo and Intense Romance, who she's up again against uh, for this rate first race, beat them last time out on soft ground. So hopefully after this weather, the soft ground will suit her. For the second race, number five, Raykib Al Hawa. A bit of an interesting um, pick for this one. Had a 71 day break, um, but came back and won over a mile and three and a half furlong. So the trip, the step up really helped him so hopefully another little bit of a step up should be good unknown about the ground but hopefully a good one to pick there now for the big race of the day the challenge cup i really like number one racing sand we're going to have a bit of a rematch between ripoff and racing sand racing sand won this one last year and ripoff came second so i wonder how that battle's going to go but for me with the ground for racing sand really suits him and also has a great record here at ascot four time winning here so could be a good one there race four i really like number two kate byron a great record here at the track two wins this season already has also won on the soft ground last time out so that again for this weather the soft ground's going to be the real player here so for race number five, and I'm going for number five, Defeda, who won this race last year on the soft ground, has a great record here at Ascot. Have a bit of a mixed season so far, but the ground really should, should suit him. Now, race number six, the last race of the day, has to be number three, came from the dark. One last time out over five furlong and looked particularly strong in the last furlong, leading the pack. Also loves the ground. It is all about the ground uh, for Saturday's place pot because it has been raining a lot. So you've got to look at the soft ground and what horses like that. Also, to make my point, you've got to put your place pots on before the first race, which is at 2 p.m. So make sure you get your bets in before the first race, 2 p.m.